So for the FLA session, we had a nice discussion what the FLA is, that we have two versions, uh, that it's not so easy to um, yeah, uh, change it and so on. One interesting thing we learned is that we should all be uh, updating the author's files more because that might be a good thing for the legal department. So um, please add yourself and the KDEV to the copyright headers if uh, that applies to uh, you if you have signed the FLA. Um, yeah, I think it was actually a really fun session considering the rather dry nature of the topic. So it was nice. Um, yeah, and the Oh yeah. So we do have FLAs to, for you to sign in the uh, team room thing. Uh, so then we also had the, the books. Uh, by the way, I just saw this. After us, cool. The books, Bob, was scheduled right now, and obviously it can't be. So I would have to reschedule it. I was hoping to have it right after frameworks. It's a five. Yeah. Five. five. Okay, books has not yet happened. Um, Albert, internationalization, localization? Yes. Yeah. So we had both uh, about translations. There's uh, some things that want to explore the possibility of using uh, web tools for translating. We uh, declared the requirements that need to happen, which is not breaking the workflow we have. And then they are going to explore if they can come up with something that makes both workflows work. And that was pretty much it. Frank, then you had a, a teaching here with Katie. Yeah, I didn't mention one Okay, uh, I started with school because I had this idea one year ago after SES Academy. And I wish to come out of course to teach students cute but with key patients. So we try we discuss something about maybe finding some junior jobs as a start to teach students how to trace KD's code, how to build KD's development environment. And then maybe after midterm we can find some uh, some KD Project that needs somebody to maintain, we need somebody to join the development. Um, so, so if if this course is uh, coming out, we may need your help to 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 tell us what kind of project we can do. Uh, we can join into this course. And actually, I hope uh, also people uh, they provide some material for Q Q. Programming, but I hope to let this course not only cute but connect to KDE more. So that's why I started this. And, uh, yeah, we have, uh, I have a note. Uh, actually, I started last year, and uh, finally today we update it again. Okay, so uh, if, if you are interested in that, uh, maybe we can have a, another learning list to this course because. We will not KD development, we maybe to why do this place. Okay, that's all. Okay, thank you. Um, Milian had a performance session this year round, and it is Sado next uh, Wikipedia, so we can streamline the whole thing. Yeah, I essentially presented the tools I use myself. Um, I was expecting some questions or people coming to me with, this is slow, can you help me fix that? No one really took that offer, but if you do have these kind of issues <coughs> in your pet project that I do not use, come to me, send me emails, I can show you how to fix your code. And yeah, I gave some tips on what to do and what not to do in Qt applications. Sorry. So nobody came to you because KDE is really fast, yeah. right? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, did we have a Wikipedia workshop? Yeah, I have it. Okay. Um, then we uh, had the visual design group already. Ricardo has the Wikifm. Do you want? Okay. Cool. 
somebody speaking for you. Like push notifications, 
and how to draw rectangles using native Android views. It was quite intense, but I hope I could deliver some information to the attendees. Thank you. Thanks. Okay. Last one, I think. Did we forget anyone? Thank you. Thank you all for day one of the workshop.